The feeling that brings two persons together. The biggest feeling that you can feel for someone or for something. That good feeling. Something. It's like a basic feeling when you're happy, when you're satisfied with everything. Like you have to, com you have to put certain commitments. Love is, first of all, love is trust to each other. There was a time between uh, understanding she's the most person, most important person in the world, and she's an idiot. It's the, time. the biggest thing that exists and that we humans share, no, and have, or the biggest goal to achieve, no. It's just a feeling with a person that is right, and and you love her. Um, a euphoric feeling that you have for your significant other. Probably romantic walks, Stanley Park, something as spontaneous, something new, an adventure, I don't know, something we haven't done ever before. Go to another country maybe. I think it has to be with the weather. I think I will I love I love city in the night and I love uh, for example here in Vancouver I love the light. I I'm, I love to see the, the buildings and the lights. Being with the person, connecting with the person, looking into that person dies. Walking downtown, night, mm -hmm. moon, stars. A sunset on the beach. It will be great. But sitting on a beach, a very silent beach together. Um, maybe going to the beach, <laughs> having some picnic. Babe, somewhere up on the mountain with this amazing view. Like Your water, dating? Close, maybe. My girlfriend. Someone that loves me for who I am, makes me laugh a lot, and who's there for me when I need it. Uh, it's nice, beautiful, nice. You know, take care of me. I love. Mm -hmm. I have a humor. Um, should be more down to earth mm -hmm. and should be honest. If I meet someone, I will know that this is the person that I need. It will be a natural person, the person that is true with himself and uh, honest with himself, you know, and, and that accept, that has respect for himself and also like um, has um, interest, you no know, creativity. I don't know. She's gotta be hot. She's gotta be like intelligent and well, you know, and somehow like you know the inner beauty, you know, in that sense. Kind. Something I can connect with, or oh, someone I can have chemistry with. She must love me, and that's enough. I will make him feel the, the most person in the world with every little, little detail that I can. Every day. I can sing in grey. I like buy a car. Just for her. If I have a kid with me and he's asking so many of these questions and creativity and stuff, I will love or I will give him or show my love to him in order to, 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 to kind of see the world with him. That would be really beautiful. Mustache? <laughs> I don't know, probably like romantic dinner somewhere, again, like this nice view, this like comfortable environment around me. So I believe she likes a band or she likes. A book or a, I don't know, an artist, you can do something about it. I can expose myself from who I really am. Like, I don't care if people judge me or what they think about me, as long as that person loves me and I love her, I'm willing to give my 100%. No. Yeah, I can forgive anything. It depends. For me, it will be really hard. Yes, because I already, I already did it. So. I love it. I believe in forgive and forget. Like, um, it's not the um, something like from responsibility. Then yeah, sure. I can.
forgave him. It depends. So hard. Like, if I love, if I love her like really a lot. And I know that she loves me, and if she was with another guy, it was maybe just for fun or one night thing, I don't care. Because I'm sure that if she loves me, she will forgive me as well. <laughs> but if it's, it's something and she's in love with that person, I will not Forgive when somebody hurt me and I forgive him. It's like also the reconciliation, no? So, of course, sometimes if, if, if somebody hurt me, of course, and believe me, people have been hurting me so many times, no? And I think everybody has been hurt among their lives, and they have to learn to forgive, no? Because also forgive is to release yourself, no? Ah, of course, yes, tons, well, not <laughs> No, not tons of things, but yeah, of course, it's, you know, like sharing love, right? So, yeah. Yes, um, my ex-boyfriend bought me a lot, like, bunch of flowers. I think the last present I've got is, like, so romantic, because um, one person gave me a star from the sky, so now I have my own star in the sky, which has my full name. I think it's like the most amazing present. Bossa Nova, jazz, all, all kind of stuff. That the whole hero from NBK. Uh, I think my best so far would be uh, Color of Love by Boys to Men. Just, just like you. Uh, who is it? Uh, Can't make him. I've just seen a face. Mm -hmm. The Beatles. Oh, yeah. So, can you sing it to me, please? <laughs> it's like, I've just seen the face, I can't forget the time or place where we just met. She's just a girl for me, and I want all the world to see we've met. Yeah. Especially, I love songs of uh, Michael Bubble, Buble, Michael mm -hmm. Buble, and Justin Azuka. Can you sing something? <laughs> um, <clears throat> But tomorrow, if a golden train came to take you away, would you go? Would you stay? Tomorrow, if a golden train came to take you away, would you go? Would you stay?